What is up, Buttercups? This is Decreeby, and today we are going to be playing Power Drill Massacre. Now, this is an alpha game, I believe, and uh, Errol Jackson, I'm sorry if I mispronounce your name, I'm terrible at pronunciations, but he, he recommended this game to me, and I've seen a couple other people recommend it to other people, and so I thought it would be fun to play it, and so I am. So let's get started. What just happened? What just happened? Jeff! What do you want, Megan? Are you okay? Ugh, I can't feel my legs. Don't worry, Jeff, I'll go get help. Megan, hurry! Be fast, my legs. This is the worst headache ever. Oh, my head hurts. But I think I'm all right. It's getting dark. Better get the flashlight out of the tea. That's all I s Better get the flashlight out of the tea. Ah, there it is. That's right. Clicky. It's a little one. Not a big one, but... Okay, not that... Ooh, lovely. Okay, so I am Megan. Don't worry, Jeff. I will go find help. Just allow me to find the flashlight real fast. Do, do, do. Um... I honestly don't know where the flashlight is, but I don't know how to walk around either. Where... Are... The flashlight? Where are the flashlight? <laughs> Grammaticalness. Important. Don't drop school, kids. Where are the flashlight? Um. Hmm. Eh, who needs a flashlight? Let's just go running into the forest. Why not? You know, the road, we probably swerved off of the road. I could just follow that, but. That's not a good sign at all. That's very dramatic music. I don't know how old this game is. I think it was uploaded to IndieDB like a, a two months ago or three, two months ago. I think it was in March. But uh, I'll leave the link down below if you guys want to download it and play it for yourself. But I have no idea what it's about. I gotta go running into the forest to find help. Where are you, Mr. Rabbit? Mr. Rabbit, my husband's in pain. Oh, that looks like a building in the distance. Maybe I can use the phone. Do they even have a phone? I don't know, but I'm gonna go there and find out. Maybe a Mr. Mr. Rabbit owns that house! Mr. Rabbit, can I borrow your phone? I can't believe somebody actually lives out in this weirdly shaped environment. Mr. Rabbit! Where are, are your home? Wow, with the grammar, again, already. I'm so grammatical. I am so grammatical. Can I fall off the building? The cliff? It's not a building! Jesus! What's wrong with my words?! I don't know. I just clipped that like crazy. I'm gonna probably turn this down. Try try not to hurt your ears too bad. Just kidding! <laughs> okay, that's, that's the last unwarranted one, I promise. All right. Ooh, walking across this dangerous cliff. I still can't words properly. How do you word? So, will somebody teach me to words? Because I'm having a hard time wording. Okay, Mr. Rabbit, why do you live so precariously? Do, 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 do. Mr. Rabbit, here I come. I don't even know if this is the right direction, but I'm running in this direction anyway, and it seems like it's working, so I uh, might as well run with it. <laughs> that turned to a potential song to just a train wreck of a word. A word. A sentence. Yes? Am I- am I visiting the monks with their bells and their gongs? Oh, dinner! Come get your dinner! Dinner's done! Or is it just one o'clock? Because one dong... <laughs> one dong. Who builds a beautiful, wonderful home out in the forest, but makes their walkway metal? Like, their stairs and their balcony is made of metal. I guess it won't collapse, hopefully. Gosh, it looks like a fortress! I don't feel like this is a house. This is a very bad sign. How do I open door? Open the door. Go through there. Yeah. See what you can- you can't do anything, can you? Okay. I am so dirty. I need a shower for my clothes. My clothes need a shower. I don't need a shower. I don't look all that dirty. I- I might be dirty, but at least I look sharp. <laughs> I can't- because polygons, so you- jagged edges, you can- yeah, see those. Get it? Yeah? No? Okay. Hello? 
Sir, will you let me in? Can I- can I at least knock? No? Okay. Action is the space key, flashlight is F. But I don't have my flashlight, because I messed up. This door is sealed shut. Gosh dang it. Maybe we should go back to the car and try to get our flashlight? I have a very bad feeling that that's important. Because I completely missed it. It told me, get the flashlight, and I couldn't figure it out, so I just gave up, and I walked away. And that's a bad... I messed up. <laughs> I hope I don't have to go backwards. This door is open. Go inside. Hell yeah! Hell yeah, go inside! Get in there! What a creepy build- I've noticed! Get in there and get murdered by somebody if you have to, but you gotta save Jeff, Megan! Don't be selfish! Do it for Jeff! Okay, god, it's dark in here. What the hell was that? Did somebody lock the door on me? Hey! Oh god, somebody locked me in. I don't even have a flashlight. This- this might be a terrible, terrible- Okay, never mind, scratch that. I'm starting over! I'm gonna get back to this point with a flashlight. Cool? Okay, stop yelling at me, don't comment below, I got it. And ten minutes later, I got locked in again. Woo! Yes! Alright, now we have a flashlight and we can see a creepy eye on the wall. After ten minutes, I finally made it back here with my flashlight. I hope it doesn't have, like, a battery power. I hope it doesn't go out. <laughs> OH MY GOD! <sighs> oh my god. What the hell? Oh, good lord. I- Oh my god. I don't know what to say. Uh, um, yeah, this is apparently a really scary game. Thanks for letting me know. There's another door over there. I'm not gonna go down there. I'm probably just gonna get murdered again. Looks like an article ripped out of a newspaper. Read it? Sure. The search continues for two missing campers in the Pocono- Pocono- I can't word. Mountains, you know what I'm talking about. Mason C. Sargent and Lori Summers of Long Island, New York have been missing since June 8th. Their campsite... Missing since June 8th. Okay. Their campsite and belongings have been located, but investigators have few leads. Police say there are no visible signs of a struggle, and this continues to be a rescue mission. The rest is missing. It's dated August 1982, five years ago. Okay, so we're 1987. And, uh, we're probably also gonna get lost forever and die. But, uh, that's probably my fault, because I'm exploring a creepy old place, and now I'm locked inside and stuck forever. An old desk, it looks like it's empty. Well, tell it to stop being empty. Okay, don't kill me, please, dear lord. Please, dear lord. Nothing here to kill me. Nothing around the corner. Oh, dear lord. Okay, can I get a snack? I'm a little hungry, you know, being murdered takes a lot out of you. I need a drink, I'm getting thirsty, I need some cheese puffs to make me happy again. Oh no. I just see machines in here and I just can't help but think, what terrible things do you think they're probably going to do to me using these machines? It's some kind of machine, I don't think I can use this. Okay, how about this one? It's the same machine, okay. I don't know why I think I would use one but not the other. Don't ask. Looks like a key! Pick it up? No! No, I don't want to pick it up. I want to leave it there. You got a key with red paint splattered on it. That was an interesting sound. Okay, what's this thing? Is this thing gonna smash my face in? Okay. I know I have a big head, but- <gasps> Shit! Did you see that? Oh god. Oh no. Oh, I'm not going over there. Sugar tunnel. That sounds awesome! I want to go and get some sugar! Pucker up! Mm, it sounds better than getting murdered. Sugar Tunnel. Where's Sugar Tunnel at? It's painted in red- Oh! Oh, look at that cute little face! See, these people don't want to harm people. Nobody draws a cute little smiley face on the wall if they're gonna murder you, right? This is a good sign. I like this place. This place is lovely. Definitely not scary at all. I love it. Hello? Okay, this is a very eerie tunnel. But it says sugar, so I'm hoping somebody comes and gives me a kiss. Hello? Somebody with lips? Anybody with lips? Ooh, a basement. Let's go down here. Hello? Is anybody here? Gosh, this game is probably one of the scariest games I've played. Like, I don't play a lot of scary games, and there's a reason for that. It's because I can't handle scary games. I freak out. If you've seen my Five Nights at Freddy's replay through, then you'd know that, that I just start panicking and saying things over and over again. Which is why I'm probably gonna repeat, hello, is anybody there about 90 billion times during this playthrough. Okay. And... 
These are really skinny walls. Really, really skinny walls. I don't like it. Something's gonna come from a corner and kill me. It's like a maze! There's... Shit. OH MY GOD! <sighs> Seriously though, like most games that are scary, like I get like a slight jump, kind of, but this one just like hurts my head. This one just, oh god. Oh my god. I don't know why I'm retrying this again. Oh, oh god! Starting over. Gosh dang it. Alright. We'll just try and find the basement, hopefully, and see uh, what there is. Hopefully we can find a place for that key. Um, where's that key? Is it over here? OH MY GOD! SCREW YOU! WHY DO YOU DO THIS TO ME?! HOLY CRAP! Oh my god. Okay, I didn't die there last time. What the hell, man? The he oh, there's something shiny in here. Looks like a key. Pick it up. Yeah, absolutely. You got a key with red paint sl splattered on it. Okay. Okay. Does it change every time I die or something? Here, let's test it. If I go in here and I die, then it stays the same. If I don't die, then it changes. Oh my god, the game changes, doesn't it? Oh my god. Oh, this is gonna be hell. Oh my god. I hope you guys don't make me play this until I beat it, because I, I don't think I will ever beat it. This game is hard. I'm terrible at hard games. Whenever I play- NO! I was supposed to run away, huh? I could probably run away instead of just stand there and get slaughtered. But, um, as I was saying, I'm terrible with hard games. Like, I play all my games on easy. Like, there's a reason- is there a key still in there? Or does the key- the key even changes. Wow! Okay, I like that. I like that the game changes. I like that it's not linear, but I'm probably gonna get murdered a hell of a lot. Okay. So, but as I was saying, all- every time I play a game, I set it to easy. What the hell was that sound? I set it to easy because I can't handle difficulty because I'm terrible at games. I am awfully terrible at games. Okay, you motherfucker. You better not come at me. I don't know why you came at me the last time. Oh my god, I have so much anxiety. I'm not a person to get stressed out. Like, I, I really don't get stressed out very much. I, I really don't. And... No! No, 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 fuck off. Fuck off. Holy shit. I... No! He's chasing me, isn't he? He's chasing me. I hear his footsteps. I'm not turning around. Holy shit, just run. Just run forever, I swear to God. Just... Oh shit. No! No! Okay, I'm so done. <laughs> God, that's loud. That's loud as hell. Oh my god, he can't kill me though! Yeah! We win! He can't hurt us! Does that mean we win or just we don't lose? Because we're stuck and he's, <laughs> he's just knifing above my head. He can't hit me. You think I can escape? God, he's creepy. Jeez, okay. <sighs> no, we're stuck. I literally, I'm stuck. He's stuck. There's, we reached a draw. Admit it, Murs person. You didn't lose. I didn't lose. You didn't win. I didn't win. It's a stalemate. Now will you be quiet, please? I'm just hitting that so that I can talk in peace and harmony. So there won't be loud buzzing annoying my ears. As for this game, I hope you don't make me finish it. Because it's hard and it's very, very scary. But if you want to see more, tell me. Thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like down below. I don't want to play more, but I will if you do. Because, yeah, you, I'll leave a link to the, the download for this game in the description below. I can't think straight anymore. I'm just so... This game is so scary. But thank you for watching if you... I already did that. Thank you all so much for watching and we'll see you next time. Hopefully with a less scary game. Like, he's just trying to be a little round ball of fuzz. And they're just like squishing him. And that's terrible. Oh my god, I'm a really large cat. Mr. Octodad, please stop pushing that button. You might cause a nuclear holocaust. What? Beep. There's a shower here. Oh, are you asking me to join you? It's... Yes. Ah, oh, yes.